All right, all right, all right, all right, all right. The Pen and Star movie is one of the most obscure things about the game. I'm sure even seasoned players, a lot of seasoned players, don't know about its existence. I'm sure this will be on YouTube, but... How... Uh, how do you even pronounce that? What the... Why he is the only guy that decided to make a video about it? Y you know what? I'm gonna bring this globally. I'm gonna do it in English now. So, this is how to get the penance armor. So in order to get the penance armor, I suggest to start off with the mercenary because uh, he's able to get the skill steal, which is be crucially important in order to get it. And just to get steel, you just have to select the option become a pickpocket during the intro. Now you have to get a lot of tinder boxes. I don't remember the exact number and I don't think it can be always the same because there are different conformations of the dungeon. Just get as much as you can. And once you reach the entrance of the second part of the dungeon, where usually there are the dark cultists, all you have to do is just to go straight ahead till you can find torture and just destroy his left arm before doing anything else, the one with the knife, because we don't want to take damage. And after that it's time to use steel on him and we will get the vault key. Funny thing, if you try to look the vault key in the items menu it doesn't have a description. Like did the developer forgot or I don't know. Now it's time to light up all the torches in this screen and I mean in all this place. In the part of the library, in the part near the human hydra, in the part everywhere. And once you do that, on the last light up torch, you will get a message telling that there is a door that is open somewhere. Just go to the room where you get access to the blood pit and you will find a new entrance. Go up there, there will be a door that can be opened with the bolt key and there it is, the penance armor is ours. Now, what does this do? It gives incredibly high defense and also resistance to limb losses if I remember correctly, but there is one inconvenience, you are getting permanently bleeding. There are ways to prevent this, there is the Ring of the Steel Blood which is a random drop from the guards I think and also you can find it from the chests, but the one I suggest to is to kill the Solomon Snake by using the Gnome Eggs uh, with the Talk option in order to make him do nothing during his turns, so he will basically be immortal and you will win as long as you have more party members. And by using a soul stone on him, you will get the Salmon Snake Soul, which prevents bleeding and limb losses. Now there is a problem. This is... I don't know if it's supposed to work like this, but basically when it says it prevents bleeding, it also says it cures bleeding if you have it on. So basically you have infinite bleed healing, but regardless of that, now you just have to put this one on and you will never get bleeding from the penance armor. And now you may say, why is the video still going? Because we are not over, this is where the dark part comes in. You may say, what if I don't start with the mercenary and I don't get an empty scroll to, to teach myself steel or I just don't want to do that? Well, there is another way to get the penance armor. <sighs> Let's start back. You have to befriend Tor Torture. How do you do that? When you told to Bachman, enter the room with it, talk a little bit to him, do all the options just to be sure. Then go to Torture and select Talk. Don't cut off his arm. Select Talk and tells he, tell him that you have the perfect subject for him. You will sell Bachman basically. And now you will befriend Torture. At this point, all you have to do is just a very simple thing. You just have to take the Cube of the Depths, go to Mahabre in the present, go near the Tower of the Endless, the place where usually the Tower of, of the Endless is present, there will be a Lord of the Flies that is carrying a girl with him, you just have to interrupt them, kill the Lord of the Flies, and at this point all you have to do is to take the girl to Torture. Now Torture is very friends with you, you have maximum affinity, the social link of Persona is completed, and he will give you the Vault Key. And he will also tell you that you have to light up all the torches in the room in order to get access to the secret room with the penance armor in it. All you have so took me like one hour of my time, so please subscribe.